I'm Jessica Munoz, the president and founder of Ho'olanapua. About a decade ago, my world was completely flipped upside down because I saw kids come into our emergency room and we weren't recognizing them as victims of trafficking. So just through my day job as a nurse, I began seeing that there is this population of children that's being victimized right here in America, right here in Hawaii. I didn't know exactly what I was supposed to do, but I knew I had to do something. There was not many people to call. There wasn't an understanding of the scope of this problem. So I started with one conversation at a time. One of the big things that we've seen with this population is that the level of trauma that they've endured, given their amount of sexual exploitation, is pretty severe. Imagine for a moment if your 11, 12-year-old daughter, niece, cousin, sister ran away for the weekend, met up with a guy at the mall who bought her a bunch of things, told her how wonderful and how beautiful she is, and next thing you know, she ends up in a situation where she's being forced to have sex for money, money that she's not keeping, money that she's giving to this guy who's exploiting her. The layers and layers and layers of abuse and violence and trauma that she would endure isn't something that she can just get over on her own. It's something that hundreds of children every single day in America are fighting. These kids need a comprehensive place of healing. This place of healing for us here in Hawaii that we're working so hard to build is called Pearl Haven. Pearl Haven is a place where children will receive comprehensive therapy, in-school education, life skill development, equine therapy, art, art therapy, dance therapy, all sorts of programming that'll be specific to them finding healthy connection, healthy relationships. It's so important with this population that you reestablish those connections in order for her to find hope, healing, and freedom. This is gonna serve as a model of care for youth who've been exploited. We desperately need to establish this model of care in the United States so that we can scale it, so we can make it sustainable, and so we can replicate it around the world. When we look at what children need, children need a safe place. They need a place where they can receive all of the therapy, the intervention, the love, the care, the support, the life skill development, the education that's so incredibly important for them as they start this road to healing. Right now in America, there's less than 600 residential treatment beds for kids who've been trafficked. There's 100,000 kids that are newly trafficked every single year. We're clearly behind. We have so much to do in this space, but we can't do it alone. We need the community to come around this issue to recognize not only that it's a problem, that it's affecting hundreds and even thousands of kids a year, but that the response to this, it's not just rescuing these kids off of the street and out of the arms of an abuser, but it's truly having a tailored response to meeting their needs. We are so excited because we raised six million out of our $9 million that's needed in order for us to open the doors of Pearl Haven. So we have $3 million to go, but we're so close to being able to open in the first part of 2021. We need your help. We can't do this without you. You can be the hero in these children's lives. You can help rewrite their story. You can help them rebuild their lives and embrace their bright future. Investing in the lives of girls transforms communities for generations to come.